uh, day 14 of the harvest log in Overbury and uh, we are continuing with the linseed. This is the brown linseed back in the grain store. Um, linseed is a funny old crop. Uh, I really wish uh, there was more money in it, more yield in it. It does wonderful things for the soil in terms of uh, nice deep tap root, uh, really breaks up the soil. Um, it's a bit of a, a pig to combine unless you get the nice right sunny day. Um, and <clears throat> for two years on the trot, it hasn't really <clears throat> yielded fantastically. Um, having said that, it is cheap to grow. It's another crop in the rotation, and these are all the things we need to consider um, and look at things over, over a wider rotation. Um, we can't <clears throat> store linseed very high or very deep at all, um, partly because if you were to walk on there now, you would uh, sink down into it, it can be quite dangerous. So um, certainly in bins, <clears throat> it's not ideal. So uh, we'll just give it a little push up. Uh, we can blow a little bit of air through it. Hasn't come in to the store particularly warm. Um, it was cloudy last couple of days, been combining it. Uh, but it is a very, a very nice grain. It's very healthy. Um, this will be crushed for uh, oil, uh, linseed oil, and um, yeah, the market is rising on it on the back of, I think, oilseed rape um, and everything going on in the world. So um, yeah, linseed should finish linseed tomorrow and then hopefully we will be uh, making a start um, on some wheat cropping.